I have a confession to make. I'm obsessed with Twilight. I just, I, I can't help it. It sucked me in. Hey guys, my name is Miranda, and yes, I know this is not my usual setup. This is actually one of my other bookshelves, and I'm actually sitting on the floor because I randomly wanted to sit on the floor. I actually have been on a beautiful journey reading Twilight, and I've been vlogging this journey. I have finished both Twilight and New Moon, the first and the second book of the saga, and so many feels. I know that it's not Monday. I I know. But right now at this rate, I'm kind of just going with the flow of my schedule and making videos when I can. I will make sure to get back on the Miranda Monday schedule because I'm missing my Miranda Mondays. Let me tell ya. Anyway, so this has been a pretty long introduction. So let's just get on with this vlog, okay? So today is Monday. I don't even know what day it is. I finished Twilight in under 24 hours uh, this past weekend. I have nothing else to say besides the fact that I thought, I thought that Twilight was not supposed to be this addicting. Under 24 hours, that's so good. But what I'm really annoyed about, let me just tell you what I'm really annoyed about. We haven't even actually gotten to know Jacob yet, okay? It's just Bella and Edward. There's no triangle here. When there's only two people, it's just a love line. We don't have Jacob. Jacob makes the love triangle. Where is he at? He's non-existent. That's where he's at. I'm just hoping that in New Moon, uh, we get more Jacob. Please, this is all I'm asking for. This is all I'm asking for. It's pretty simple. Really, really, I'm just asking for the third part of my love triangle. <sighs> hey guys, um, it's uh, Tuesday and I'm at school right now. So last night I read more of New Moon. When Edward and his family had the audacity to get up and leave. I mean, I, it serves them right. Edward and Bella were way too obsessed with each other. Like, come on, chillax. But come on, Edward knew. Edward knew how she felt about him. And then he just runs away, breaks her heart, doesn't even care. <laughs> but Jacob, my friends, <laughs> stop laughing. <laughs> Jacob is slowly coming in. It's slowly tr starting to be a love triangle now. So it makes me happy because I love Jacob and I appreciate how Bella likes him for his personality. Not because he looks good. Cause like with Edward it was always, oh, but he dazzled me every time I looked at him. What the heck girl? But Jacob, <laughs> Jacob, he, it's his personality and how he makes her feel so happy all the time. He is hot. I love Jacob right now. I really like Jacob and I appreciate him and how he's helping her through this process and how he is there for her and how he just has to be himself and she appreciates that and I just love it. I, I love it. I've been carrying this around all day because it's my aesthetic. I'm at dance so don't mind me looking like a clown but Jacob just told Bella that they can't be friends anymore. And he stormed away from her. I can't take this. I literally... <laughs> it's really late. But I need to say something. I am so mad at Bella. Does she not realize how happy she could be if she let everything with Edward go? She's just torturing herself by obsessing over Edward and not assessing the wounds he left behind. She just needs to let go and heal, actually heal. And now she knows that Jacob's a werewolf, so that's good. I'm glad that all of that was resolved. That makes me really happy. But the fact that she keeps refusing to heal, I know she's hurting, but, no girl 
and poor Jacob is getting the brunt of all this. Jacob. I love Jacob. I just got to the part in New Moon where Alice pays a visit to Bella's house. And then we find out later that Edward thinks Bella is dead and so he decides to, to kill himself. He's not dead yet. As far as we know anyways, he, he could be dead. But is this not an exact replica of Romeo and Juliet? I'm, what is going on? Life is so much more than one other person. I mean, I'm just saying it. Like, come on, man. Come on! He's just as bad as Bella. They both are just... Maybe they are meant to be together because both of them are super dumb at this point. Jacob is so much smarter. He's like the solid intelligence in this story that is keeping me sane. <laughs> Don't get me wrong, I'm still obsessed. Like, this story has got me hooked, but... Come on, Edward. On a happier note, Tonight, I'm having some friends over and we are watching the first movie of Twilight. Boom. I've never seen it, so it's gonna be a party and I'm totally gonna be fangirling the whole entire time. I'm just saying, I'm just letting you know. <laughs> so guess what I'm watching? My babes. My babes. <laughs> <laughs> so, um... Um, I, I don't know what to think right now. <laughs> I just finished New Moon. It's so good. I'm really torn right now. On which side I'm on? Team Edward doesn't look so bad right now. But Team Jacob... I'm really tired. It's like really late at night. I don't even know how to express my thoughts right now because the fact that Bella has chosen to get married to Edward, I mean obviously that's her actual choice. Is, is this the end of her and Jacob's relationship? There was barely a love triangle. Like she only saw him as a best friend. So I don't see how that actually is a love triangle, but you know what? It's fine. Plus the movie. So good. Super cheesy. And super hilarious because it was cheesy, but it was so good. It was, I loved it. I loved it. It didn't do so much justice, but it did. It did some justice. It made me really happy. <laughs> oh my gosh, this series is so crazy. I've been through so many emotions and I really love it. It's just very intriguing. The characters and the way that they deal with each other and Bella's feelings. So far, I'm really digging it. Can't wait for the rest. Now I just gotta start reading Eclipse, but not until I get some sleep. Because I need that. That's it. Thank you guys so much for watching. I love you all so, so much. You have no idea how much I love every single one of you who watches my videos. Like, it means so much to me. Please be safe, make good choices, and I will see you next week. Love you guys.